Hey, it's Rocky Mike for you from Horseplay Gaming, and uh, today I am going to show you how to get um, Microsoft Expression uh, to record your screen of your uh, PC. Now, uh, Fat Smurf did a uh, familiar tutorial on how to do this on Mac, and he used ScreenFlow, and uh, I'm going to show you how to do it on the PC using Microsoft Expression. So, um, go to the link in the description, take you straight to Mediafire and uh, download that and uh, go through the installation process and then you should get uh, if I can find it okay whatever we'll just use this same thing but <laughs> I wanted to show you actually the whole program but this is what you're going to be using to um, actually um, record your uh, your desktop and um I'm using Camtasia right now to record this and um I don't use this anymore. Like it came with, you know, editing tools and stuff, but it's honestly not that good because um every time I go into Minecraft, my guy will like start spinning and stuff, like cuz it lags out so much. And um so I don't necessarily want that. And I couldn't find any settings to um drop the frame rate down. So I looked around and I found this, and um, no lag, crystal clear quality, and uh, you can adjust the frames to your liking for your computer. Um, so um, yeah, it's a very nice, simple program. There's your settings for the webcam, and then here's your other settings. So I can change the frame rate to whatever I want. I keep it at 30, and uh, that seems to be good. No lag on Minecraft. Uh, I want to leave the bitrate at the same, 95 out of 100, that's pretty good quality. And then you can choose to capture your mouse or not. Um, that's for your webcam. Audio settings are really nice and uh, very customizable. Like, um, you, I'm use the like, Turtle Beaches to uh, record. So I just record the sound of the Turtle Beaches. So what I can hear from my computer would be the speakers Turtle Beach at. And then um, my Turtle Beach set microphone, which is not on, but there it is. And then um, let's say I'm doing like a dual commentary, and I plugged in like an EA mic. Like my friend could, you know, use that EA mic, and then I could use the Turtle Beaches, and then we could, you know, both do a commentary at the same time uh, while recording with this. And then so we use hotkeys to start, pause, stop recordings, and um, other than that, um, that's it. Um, of course, this is the light version, um, so to speak. But um, what the light version does is you can only record for 10 minutes and you have to stop and record again. And um, it's not too much of a problem for me considering that like, if you're just starting on YouTube, um, the videos can only be 10 minutes. So um, that it's almost sort of good for uh, people who are just starting and um you know once it ends like here I'll record for you so you can choose where you want to record I don't necessarily know how to drag this but yeah well you can you know just change your um width and height and then uh, you just hit ca uh, record and then it'll tell you all this and um it'll hide into your little uh options give it a nice countdown and then I'm recording on this too so I'll do this it might be a little laggy since I'm recording Camtasia's recording and uh, this is recording at the same time but it saves right to your desktop or wherever you want to save it and um yeah so let's say you reach your full 10 minutes in your video um all you gotta do well it'll like automatically stop but let me just right click stop here and I'll stop because your 10 minutes is up it's, that was only like 30 seconds but if it did breach like that full 10 seconds it would stop and go to here and all you gotta do is like that record again and that took I don't know like 5 seconds to do so it's pretty easy to um, just get past that 10 minutes and then that's how you can split up your videos so Honestly, that's not really a problem. Maybe for some other people, but uh, for me, and if you're filming Minecraft and stuff, um, honestly, 
that's probably the way to go. Um, you can always just buy the full version if um, it's a problem. I'm not sure what the price is, but um, it's really good. Now, um, if you want to um, actually, like these may get into like a small compressed file, so you just send that to the encoder. And um, I'll start up, and you can start encoding um, the file that you want to encode. And uh, it's really easy. And then you can always just drop these captures into uh, Sony Vegas Pro 9 or 10. Or any editing software that uh, you like. And uh, this also comes with an editing software. And then you can, um, you know, edit where you want to. It shows my video up here. And, um, yeah, and just cut whatever you want. Go through whatever you want. And uh, it's a great program. And uh, so don't hesitate to get it just go in the description and um, download that media fire link and it'll uh, just go through the setup process and then you should get uh, Microsoft expression and uh, it's virus free it'll be free to download it and um, yeah hope you like this uh, please leave a rating it's just below the video just hit the like button it really helps me out hopefully you can get maybe 10 likes Seems small, but that's actually a lot for us. And it'd be great if you left the ratings. So, uh, yeah, this is how to get uh, Microsoft Expression uh, to record your screen on your PC. Hope you liked it, and uh, see you later.